Google Bard has just been rebranded to Google Gemini. Yes, it's still the same Google Bard, but with a few more features. And why the rebrand from Google Bard to Google Gemini? I'll tell you soon. Real quick, boost your online security with today's sponsor, Aura. All-in-one protection from cyber scams, financial fraud, and online predators. Safeguard your identity and enjoy built-in antivirus and VPN with Aura. Click my link below for a free two-week trial. Okay, let's take a look at the all-new Google Gemini. So what is Google Gemini? Well, Google Gemini is simply just a rebrand of Bard. As you can see in this email I got from Google just a few days ago, Bard is now Gemini. And there's a few notes here as well. So now when we go to Bard or now Gemini, you get presented with this message here. So we'll close this and this is the new interface. Here is Google Bard a couple of weeks ago and here is Gemini. Again, looking at Bard compared to Gemini, you can see that it looks very similar, but there are a few differences which I'll highlight with a bit of a tour of Gemini. And later I'll explain why they rebranded Google Bard to Google Gemini. Now doing a quick tour of Gemini, we can see on the left hand side, we now have a pane and this is very similar to ChatGPT. We've got new chat, help, activity, settings, where we can manage extensions, manage our private links, change to our dark theme if we like, and have real-time responses or show it when it's complete. Then we have upgrade to Gemini Advanced. So this is quite a big inclusion now because we have a subscription-based model. And to access that, we can see the pricing here. You get a couple of free months for now, and then after that, you're looking at around 20 US dollars. This is what you get, most capable AI model, Ultra One. State-of-the-art performance, designed for highly complex tasks, you also get two terabytes of storage, and then later on, Gemini and Gmail, Docs and more, plus other Google One premium benefits. Now, if you choose to activate that subscription, you can choose between regular Gemini or Gemini Advanced, but I guess once you've upgraded, you wouldn't want to not to use Gemini Advanced. This button here actually makes the sidebar go smaller or bigger. And then coming over to the main interface, again, it's very similar to ChatGPT where you just enter your prompt here. But now, as you can see in this video here, there is a free built-in AI image generator, which you can use by just asking it to create an image, create a picture of, or something similar to that. So again, I can type my prompt in, I can upload an image, or even use the microphone to speak. And in the top right, this is where we have our account details. For a complete video on how to use Google Gemini, check out the video above. So some other differences between Google Gemini and Google Bard. Google Gemini AI, as opposed to Google Bard, is trained on a diverse and expansive data set comprising text, code, images, and audio. This comprehensive training empowers Gemini AI with a deeper understanding of language and the world. While Gemini AI excels across various data types, Bard remains primarily focused on text-based information. So why the rebrand? Well, Google's shift from Bard to Gemini alongside the adoption of a subscription model, as I demonstrated earlier, underscores its strategic response to the ever-evolving landscape of the AI market, as well as its ongoing competition with industry leaders such as Microsoft and OpenAI. Google's Gemini AI, part of the Google Gemini suite, represents a leap in artificial intelligence technology. Known for its advanced capabilities, including Gemini Ultra and Google Bard, Gemini AI has become a focal point in AI news. This AI tool not only enhances Google's AI offerings, but also provides users with sophisticated insights and functionalities. Learning how to use Gemini AI allows access to the forefront of AI developments, making it a must explore for enthusiasts and professionals alike. Check out this video next to see the new Google Gemini free AI image generator. Also subscribe to the channel so you can get more AI updates as they happen. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.